much. Who says they can't do it at Vitality Bowls on Cal Ave? Not I, bro. Not I. Man, I needed this. Heather's been driving me up the forking wall, dudes. I mean, I know she seems like the perfect girlfriend. Super hot, tight little ass, doesn't poop. But, <laughs> <laughs> I'm not totally satisfied. In bed. Uh, what's up? You guys ain't boinking? <laughs> No, man, it is not that. We boink constantly. Noise! Yeah. <laughs> like, join twins attached at the ugly <laughs> Yeah, I mean, it's, uh, yeah, it's so cool. It's just like, uh, I don't know, it's just like, um, she's not tender with me. <laughs> I mean, it's just like after we make love, but uh, yeah, she just like rolls over, uh, queefs and then falls asleep. Here you go, bro. I feel that. Every time I try to pull out a trout, Tabitha slaps it out of my hand and she's like, oh, I don't use condoms. They feel weird. And then she demands that I come on her face. I feel pressure. <laughs> <laughs> well, I mean, we're all sharing that bros crunch like bros do. Heather uh, has never once made me come. <laughs> Guys! Oh. Hey, dudes, oh. come on! It's something Heather's pretty insecure about. But meanwhile, I'm out here waiting for my mangasm like it's the damn rapture. She's <laughs> 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 up sexual energy, and I'm about to plot. <laughs> Johnny, Johnny, John, plot. Look at me. You're normal, okay? A woman has not one time allowed me to climax. <laughs> Women just don't know how to pleasure a man. I thought that I couldn't orgasm. That my body was physically incapable of ejaculating. That I was broken. Then I realized that it wasn't me. It was my partner, Tabitha. <laughs> I can't believe you guys have this problem with your ladies, too. Even Tabitha. Obviously. <laughs> Yeah, 75% yeah, of men can't orgasm from intercourse alone. That's a staggering figure in one that society, and GQ, doesn't talk about enough. <laughs> most men can't come just from penetration, and most women don't know that. It's like, we can't just pump that out after three drills the way a lady can. I need to be blind and die. I need candles. I may need a post hand every now and then. Never to change it. <laughs> my vibrator out of the nightstand and finish myself off in the ensuite? <laughs> what? You don't own a vibrator? You do? Uh, yeah. We all do. Uh, right up the butt. focused on the shaft, okay? She goes at that thing like she's trying to start a damn fire. <laughs> but my orgasm is a full body emotional experience. I can't come unless we're holding hands, kissing, and naming our future third child, okay? What about my needs? I'm a woman! You can't forget about the balls! Yeah. The balls are the male clits! <laughs> way more sensitive, because there's two of them. Yes, kid! That is such solid math. Love that. Yeah, I mean, it's kind of where it's like they can't find them, but meanwhile, I'm journeying to the center of the folds like Brendan F. and Frazier is. <laughs> <laughs> what hurts me the most about a parent is that she doesn't even check to see if I'm hard before hopping off. She has no idea that half the time I'm just pushing rope. <laughs>
using your disco stick to have one, two, three, four consecutive orgasms. They think with their clit. Dude, it takes almost no literal effort. I'm no Meryl, but I'm pretty sure I could wear the golden glove for my performance in the bedroom. Yeah, you can just, just close your eyes, kind of flare your nostrils a little bit, and then grimace like you got a whiff of that condom body, and it's spoiled. <laughs> okay? Yeah. I'll do this here, I guess. <laughs> Backing me up? Okay. 